You know, it's August out there. It certainly is. There are some people who were probably wondering what month it was and <laughs> turned on Late Night with Conan O'Brien to find out. Well, no. my work is done. Let's go. Yeah. Good night, everybody. No, uh, this is the time of year. It's a beautiful time of year, actually. People get some vacation. Mm -hmm. it, you got to get outdoors. Got to get outdoors. Yeah. And, a, and a lot of people actually go camping. Mm -hmm. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, Andy and I have for years, we've known each other five years now, we're always talked about, hey, wouldn't it be great if the two of us could get away and just go camping sometime like real buddies? Yeah. Real amigos. We're, yeah. <laughs> we're, both, we're both very big outdoorsmen. Exactly. Mm -hmm. As people can tell from our on-air personalities. Exactly. <laughs> So, uh, so we did just that, actually, uh, a couple of days ago, Andy and I packed up all our gear, put on our hiking boots, and we went camping in the great American wild, and we had a terrific time, and we actually brought a film camera with us and uh, filmed the whole thing, and, well, ladies and gentlemen, enjoy Andy and I going camping. A good spot. Just, just build the tent around me. Okay. <laughs> Look what I brought. <laughs> You're gonna be happy about that. Oh yeah. Wait a minute. Look at this. Oh man. Woo! All right. Here we go. We're gonna party. <laughs> We got a lot of great food to cook, but can't cook it without firewood. You gotta have an open fire to cook your food when you're camping, so. So we're gonna take care of that right now. Oh, look out, there's a spider. Snacky, handy snack pudding. Oh, great. Let's have some of those. Yeah. Spam. You like spam. Yeah. Let's have spam. I'll open that up. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Kinda a little of that on there. You know, Andy, the Indians used to cook eggs like this. Uh-huh. Which is why you don't see any of them anymore. <laughs> and next time, we, we should get unscented toilet paper. Okay, get your uh, sleeping bag out. And shake it out before we. <laughs> Folks, this is uh, John Harrington. He's the chief ranger here at the park. And uh, I guess the first question we have for you is. Uh, do people mistake you a lot for Wilford Brimley? No, I don't think so. Really? No. You like, uh, Oat Bran? Mm -hmm. What is it? What is he? Are you fired up about Oat Bran? Oh, I love Oat Bran. Sure. Oh, shoot. Hey, can I make a call on you? Is that all right? How would I call the headquarters on this? What do you do? Can you turn it on for me? Sure, I can turn it on for you. Uh, this is John. Can I have Welch Beach, please? Welch Beach, this is John. We see that. Uh, we see that. Thank you. We've got a Sasquatch out here. I've never seen anything like it. Good Lord, he's coming for my vehicle! Would you, would you put on a bear suit for us? Uh, no. <laughs> would you put on just the bear head? No. Just take a second. 
You uh -huh. put it on for a second. We just want to tell people when we so get back home that we saw a we bear, saw a bear driving a recreational if, vehicle. If you don't do it, then one of us has got to do it. Ooh. Can you just put it on for a second? It's just a bear head. All right, I'll put on your bear head. We have the bear head right over here. Bring it over right now. Hurry. You think you could just drive this thing like just not even that far? Just drive it just a little bit. I'll turn it on for you. You all right? I think, you know, I'd like to see where I'm going. It's really not necessary. Yeah, it'll be fine. Oh, I'm sorry. That's I'm sorry. Like... I no, I interrupted the lighty dive. <laughs> let, me, let me just load you up there, and, and then I heard the words—the words I had been dreading. Ladies and gentlemen, David Hasselhoff. <laughs> and then the curtains opened, and there he was. Every hideous six foot two inch of him. And he came towards me. He came towards me like a, like a monster. And he didn't shake my hand. Well, I haven't slept much since then. Some people say Earth the Kid is in these woods. And it may be sometime in the middle of the night when I'm asleep. She'll come into the tent. And I'll have to interview her again. So, uh, Hi, John. Hi, John. We'll see you. We'll never forget you. I'll never forget you. Well, we're here on our own. I told you we should have knocked him out and took that thing. That truck. <laughs> now what? Come back, ladies and gentlemen, bringing out all his uh, crazy animals. Jim Fowler is going to be here. Someone will get hurt, I guarantee you.